good day and welcome to today's autodesk inventors class all right today we'll be considering the problem as displayed on the screen so i'm going to pick my uh start then pick one of my plane i'm going to produce a rectangle in this manner a rectangle of 50 on this plane then 60 on this plane all right having it in that order i'm developing the plan of this object that's where i'm actually going to draw it from so that i can get the 3d view at a go so i'm drawing this line right here i'm drawing this right here then i'm drawing this right here so picking my dimension so from here to here is going to be distance of 30 okay from here to here is going to be distance of 10 all right and from here to here is going to be distance of what distance of 10 enter so after doing that what is the next procedure what is the next procedure i'm picking my line also all right so i'm drawing this like this and like this all right so distance between this and this is uh 10 if that is the case then year to year should be what 20 so that is settled as it is over there so then i'm left with this i'm picking a rectangle okay standing right there a rectangle of uh 10 by 10 10 by 10 that's going to be a square instead of a rectangle that's a square sorry so let me dimension it first okay so 10 then this area should be mark of 10 right here and this area is going to be mark of five right here okay so i'm going to uh mirror let me mirror this okay don't let me use mirror let me just reproduce it so picking that also standing right there so 10 by 10 enter so the dimension here to here is going to be five while here to here is going to be 10 also so i have that on the screen okay after doing that what is the next procedure i'm going to actually uh, trim this area off if i want to yeah let me just trim it off okay then what finish sketch finishing my sketch right now i'm going to turn it this way then tilt it this way so take note so using my extrude command i'm extruding the whole of this area and this area at a distance of 10 okay then what enter so i'm going to share my sketch picking my extrude command also so uh this area on the inside yeah at a distance of what five all right at a distance of five then what okay so uh, i'm going to ex ex uh, edit this is my first extrusion i have to pick this area yeah together along with it that area then what okay so that's my object now so i'm going to click on extrude again uh, this bottom part at height of what 25 plus 30 that's what height of 55 then what enter so i'm going to pick my fillet fillet of radius what 25 and i'm going to fillet this edge and what this edge then what okay so now i can tilt this object this way let me hide my dimensions okay so clicking on this surface i'm going to what create a new sketch all right picking my rectangle i'm going to produce the first one is 30 by 20 so 20 there 30 there so i'm having it in that order so let me dimension it okay so uh from the bottom to the bottom here is going to be distance of 20 enter and here is going to be what mark of what 10 enter so it's already positioned like that i'm going to draw another one uh that one is going to be uh 10 by 20 enter so then i'm going to centralize that also so from here to here is going to be five enter and from here to here is going to be five enter so then i'm going to what finish my sketch so finishing my sketch i'm going to use my extrude command uh this in now i'm going to use through all then what cut i'm having what this as you can see on the screen so clicking on this i'm going to what share my sketch click on extrude clicking on extrude i'm going to pick only that surface 
okay at a depth of what depth of five then i'm going to pick what cut then what okay so i can add my what add my dimensions also now that is my object on the screen as you can see that's the production of the problem displayed on the screen in autodesk inventor theory d my name remains olua tumbi blessing or lalekon the founder of michael tech kindly ensure you subscribe to this youtube channel and also refer to your friends who might be in need of it thank you